Welcome everybody to another episode of Cap Talk. Today, episode 130. Oh my god, this is crazy and this is a special one because today is a special Sunday. We all know today is the Super Bowl and oh my god, I am so fucking ready for this night. I am absolutely fresh and I will be, yeah, I'll be, I'll be in front of the screen the whole night because I can't wait to see this game today and probably you can already see it. If you know, you know what did, which this player is. I'm going old school today with a jersey from Cherry Rice from the 49ers. Wide receiver legend, won three Super Bowls and um, I'm going for the 49ers today. But I also want to know uh, which team you think is winning today. And we are straight starting away with this um, today and I give you two minutes um, on the poll that you can tell me where you think who is winning today and welcome to the stream I have a little problem today because I cannot see on this screen the chat because there is just a fucking um, cookie banner on it and I cannot remove it because it's that fucking long but I can see everything here on my other screen because I told you that the studio is going to be adapted. So, I mean, we, we, we just went over here and now we, we set up all the spaces and all that stuff. We did all the planning and now um, it's getting adapted already because why? Um, maybe some of you guys have seen that I bought a new microphone. So the new microphone should be ready in the next two weeks because there will be, it will be completely revamped. And when this is done, I'll make a, I'll make a video about that, right? Because you guys, I, we ask you guys what you want to see in the future and you will see a lot more content coming from us and also different stuff because we want to engage you much more in the process what we are doing every day. So there were a lot of questions like, um, yeah, can you make some 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 cuts when you are, for example, designing hats? When Pierre and I are designing hats with our rep, of course we can do that. So there will be some more content coming soon because we listen to you guys and we want that you guys can um, follow what we are doing. This is very important for us and I hope you guys appreciate that. So I'm looking, we are already at 75 um, 75 um, viewers today. So I'm sorry. I'm already so pumped. Look how close this is. So just two seconds left. And now we got a result. The Chiefs win by 52% of you guys say that the Chiefs are winning the Super Bowl today. Well, well, I mean, it will be a super, a super good uh, Super Bowl tonight. This is, this is something I'm pretty sure, right? Um, but I cannot say so I think it will be super close and I already was asked today what I think how the result will be and I just let me look it up because uh, let me look it up let me look it up so I said today that the Niners will win 31 to 24 so this is my official my official result that I'm um, giving in today. Let me know in the chat what you guys think. All right. So Kuba was the first today. Ricky5950 is here. And shout outs to Michigan, to my man, Archdog7. Sink is here. Onside Leo is here. Seahawker is here. Capmaster Flash, Seabass613. V Godson is here. And of course, also our friend from Hamburg, Cap Chris Hamburg. Super Bowl Sunday, Moin Toppers family. <laughs> John is here, and of course, our OG Berg79 is also here. And he says, Go Niners, as expected. Cap Brudy is here, Lali King is here, Jacob is here, and a lot of other guys. True BK Warrior is back again. Thank you for tuning in. Capstar is auch am Start. And my friend from Colorado, the Lost Latvian, is also here. Fantastic. Mr. Pink is here, Mr. Casanova. And shout outs to my brother in Italy. 
Shoutouts to Como. Ross the Bear is also here. So, guys, I mean, isn't that fantastic? Do you have to work tomorrow or not? So, can you do? I mean, this is more a question for the European guys, right? Because we have to wait until one o'clock in the morning uh, that the Super Bowl is starting. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, so, I mean, we have to, to, to stay awake the whole night. But I'm, I'm really sad. So after the stream, I'm a little bit in a hurry because I have to go over to, um, to Hooters to pick up my chicken wings, right? Uh, so I, I, I ordered like 40 chicken wings for me. And um, then, I'm, then I'm heading home. I'm watching the Super Bowl today at home and hanging a little bit out. Uh, morgen ist Rosenmontag und in Köln ist frei. Oh, I forgot about that. True that. So this is a collision of, of, of the big events, right? So Carnival in Cologne and the Super Bowl nearly at the same time. Oh my God, this is crazy, right? Capstar said he is now four weeks. He's four weeks on vacation. Oh my God, this is great. Four weeks is crazy. I think I have, I have not. No, nah, I've never been on four weeks vacation. Never. No, I'm, I'm pretty sure I've never been. <laughs> um, Berg says 49ers are winning 24 to 21 with the game winning field goal. Oh, yeah. Uh, so Lali King says he is also free tomorrow. That's great. That's great. Super nice to hear that, guys. And thank you for tuning in. It's another Sunday today. And um, we are going... We are going um, now on Sundays with Cap Talk. And I appreciate that, that you have also switched over and we are already at 80 people in here thank you very much for tuning in and we got a lot of things to discuss because first i would like to start off with the revamp of the studio so you will not see that much right because i mean this is the setup this is but but this is just one setup we are preparing and i i don't know if you've seen it in my story um I showed you the basement and this is a house and I already asked you in my story today or no at the topper store story. So if you're on Instagram, go to the topper store story. We need a name for this house here. This house is going to be insane because we are we, we have so much space here that we can set up multiple things. Right. So the marketing team is working over here. We have the photo studio where all the hats are getting shot and um, all the product pictures are getting made. Much more space now. We got something else special, which I don't want to tell you right now because um, this should be a surprise in the future. Um, no, I don't. I, I cannot tell you right now because uh, it's not set up already, but you will see it. it. So there's a lot of surprises this year. And then we got the whole basement and the basement is like one, two, three, four, five different rooms. They look super nice. So everything is white. Um, as I said, it's a basement. It's white with the gray floor in it. And um, we are making different sets in there. So expect different content in the future also from us. And um, yeah, so maybe you have already seen also on YouTube, we are releasing a video nearly every Wednesday when I'm not, so that there was just one break because I, I got sick. <laughs> but if you have not seen the video um, from last week, it's like, what's the difference between the 5950 and the 5950A frame for those of you guys who want to know that. And yes, I, I mean, I come to the, to the stream questions later. If you're in Discord, please put in the stream questions. I will go through them later. And one question I want to, want to pick out because um, I got it a lot. Is the 5950A frame also coming to Europe? Yes, it's already on the way and we will be the first to release it. And there will be another silhouette later this year that we are also releasing. So watch out for that, right? Um, Derobin is asking um, on German, I, I'll, I'll answer it on German. Darf man die Caps waschen, also in der Waschmaschine? Um, ich würde sie nicht in der Waschmaschine waschen. Ich würde wirklich nur... Um, mit Cap Pfleger drüber gehen, auf jeden Fall nicht in der in der in der Waschmaschine waschen. Ja? Alright, so he was asking if you can wash the hats in a washing machine. And I would not do that because you know the brim, especially on the new era hats, is made of paper. So this might be trouble. Um, and I'm just going through my hats with brush and um, with 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 the head care 
like uh, Chase Mark, for example, that we are having in the store. I would not, I would not do, I would not do it in a in the in the washing machine. All right, um, Pat, we need more NBA crossovers and NFL crossovers with the team scripts. Um, so, as you might know, crossovers are. It's very hard to get them approved. It's not allowed, right? So um, watch out. There will be some new stuff, which is coming soon. So some NBA hats. We already did some NFL hats. And we are also looking into new licenses, which also will be on Europe and the US store on both. And wait for it. Wait for it. Uh, Mr. Casanova is asking, I hope to see more Snap A-frames. I will give you an early preview today of a new collection and there will be a lot of A-frame snapbacks because you guys uh, were asking us a lot to bring new stuff in and um, it will be also part of the show in the future to show off more A-frame snapback hats and they are coming on both stores. So they are coming on the US store and the European store, right? We need more White Sox hats with the fat uh, 95th anniversary side patch. Wait for it, wait for it. I got a super clean one coming and i got maybe one you guys were waiting a long time to get your chance to get your hands on this head right and um wait for it wait wait for it wait for it no crossover problems on all pittsburgh teams ricky 5950 that's true so just that you know um we at topper store we are huge sports fans right and wait for it we have a lot of history coming a lot of history in the pipe and this is probably one of our favorite things uh, to hook with because um you know for us it's always important to have sports history also in the head and picking teams who have a rich sports history and um mostly those things are hooked to our favorite things if we're making hooks like there's a lot of uh rap music because we we are huge rap music fans um pierre and i uh will do a lot of stuff in the future you guys will absolutely love it right so okay we need to see some heads right now okay kuba i'm i'm sorry for that but let's let's start it like this um i mean we have now opened up a pre-order on Topper Store USA. So, so just that you know, this beauty, the Dodger Dog is going on pre-order. It's now live on pre-order. So if you are in the US, uh, you can pre-order this hat right now. And the second one, it's already curved because I already grabbed it, is the El Paso Chihuahuas. And um, this is also now open for pre-order in the United States, right? So. For the next season, we need Vikings with side patches. Um, Berg, get ready for that because now there are side patches available. And you know, this took some time, um, but now our side patches available and I will do this for sure, right? So this is very important for me because it's not, it has not been done yet at Topper Store and uh, we need it for, for the collections. We need this for the collections. All right, guys, so we are close to Close to 90 people already. Thank you very much for tuning in and welcome to Cap Talk. Okay, so let's see what we have on the minor leagues tomorrow in Europe. And I always tell you now in advance which store I mean so that there is no confusion. This hat has already been curved because I rocked it already. But tomorrow is the day. The Binghamton Rumble Ponies in this biker edition are dropping tomorrow and look at this rumble this front logo is absolutely crazy silver with the red metallic comes straight out of the pipes of this motorcycle and then we got the all-star game side patch and um of course a minor league batterman on the back and i don't know if you can see this is like black waxed cotton canvas Oh, there is something. I don't know. Can you see that in the camera? I try to. This is really a super nice material. We need some old school Timberwolves fitters from the KG era. There is coming exactly a hat that you will love. <laughs> All right. So this beauty is dropping tomorrow at Topper Store in Europe. And make sure that you get it if you want it. Because if it's gone, it's... Uh, it's gone. It's gone maybe forever. 
I'm pretty sure the percentage is very high that it's gone forever because um, we are not doing a pre-order on this one in Europe. All right, so the second thing was a wish from some of you guys. Uh, so this is very classic and I'm pretty sure that you maybe you maybe have to buy two hats tomorrow at the, at the Topper Store Minor League Monday. So we got the Hollywood Stars. And this turned out to be so fantastic. The Gilmore Field side patch. It's the first time that we are dropping the Hollywood Stars in Europe. Jesus, look at this beauty. Oh my God. Now we got a flat batterman on the back. The dome is in stone. We got a black visor, black button, Kelly green UV, white guts. This one is dropping tomorrow at Topper Store in Europe. Is there already an update regarding the pre-order on the Fredo, uh, Freddy Fresno Grizzlies? Yes, this should arrive very, very soon. So in the United States, it already arrived. It had a little delay because of that problem in the Red Sea with these uh, guys who are shooting at our ships. And um, yeah, so this is, this is the, the reason why. So we cannot do anything about that because they have to go a longer route. So approximately two to three weeks uh, delay, but I'm pretty sure it will arrive very, very soon, okay? As soon as it is here, I give you guys, of course, an update and um, then you will directly get the head if you pre-order the head. All right. All the pirates are wearing topper heads. Hopefully not, because then they are wearing your heads. <laughs> then um, we need to make a pickup somewhere, <laughs> somewhere else uh, down there. <laughs> no, uh, everything should be fine. Hi, Pat, will the Mr. Matt's Black Dome drop in, in Europe? Um, ju sorry, just joined the stream. The Mr. Matt Black Dome will not drop. So not all of these mascots are coming to Europe because there will be another Mr. Matt dropping in Europe, a different version. And there's also one Mr. Matt dropping this week. So stay tuned. This is probably the best Mr. Matt I've ever made. <laughs> just that you guys know, just that you guys know. All right, so let's go ahead. We are close to 100 people already. Thank you guys very much for tuning in. And Stixon is here. Thank you for tuning in. All right, so before we go ahead, I would like to show you the Minor League Monday tomorrow in the United States. And this might be a Minor League Monday if you like music, you know, if you know, you know, it's the Woo Sox, which is dropping tomorrow at Topper Store USA. And there are not a lot. We dropped them in store. And now some of these, only a little amount, will make it to the online store. And Worcester Woo Sox are dropping tomorrow at Topper Store USA, gray UV, black and yellow. If you know, you know. <laughs> and the second is the Potomac Cannons in this sneaky two-tone with a lot of silver in the front and a Carolina League side patch. This one is also dropping tomorrow at Topper Store, USA, flat minor league batter man, of course, gray UV, white guts. White guts. All right. So I hope you guys uh, can enjoy today the Super Bowl. I, I, want, I want to ask you because, I mean, we have, we have voted, but I have not asked you, are you watching the Super Bowl today? Yes, sir. Nah. All right. So one minute. You have one minute time um, to answer. Oh, my God. I shifted myself out of the picture. That's not good. I'm sorry for that. All right. Are you watching the Super Bowl tonight? And oh, my God. It seems that a lot of you guys are watching. So if you make photos, how are you watching the Super Bowl tonight? Tag me on your Instagram at Petlanta or at Topper Store with your hats, with your food. I mean, the most important thing is 
beside watching the game is getting a lot a lot of food in and i will eat a lot that's for sure because i love that so chicken wings are getting cooked already i got hot dogs i got tons of potato chips cheetos i don't know i don't got that many sweet stuff and of course i got some ice cold Budweiser's in the fridge all right so Let's see. A lot of you guys are watching the Super Bowl today. Okay, I was expecting that. I was I was absolutely expecting that. Of course. So, let's see. I hope that we will have a, a crazy good night. Um, Jimmy G on the head today. Nice. Bongo. Hello, Bongo. Thank you. Yeah, I was thinking. I was thinking. I mean, come on. It's like cherry rice. And this is probably one of my favorite jerseys because it's a starter jersey. And super nice condition. I bought this in the United States and then I said, okay, I need to wear my Jimmy G uh, hat today because I think there were some leftovers our girls in the warehouse found and put up because I think Capstar wrote me a message that he got the Jimmy G now. And um, yeah, so let's see. Let's see. And I, I'm rooting for the 49ers today because I think it's the third time now... Um, Sorry, I cannot read that. Why is the chat frozen now? No, so it's the third time that Kyle Shanahan comes to the Super Bowl. I think it's the third time, right? Yeah, it must be the third time. So the first time was with the Falcons, um, where he was offensive coordinator. And uh, then he got also with the 49ers against the Chiefs. And now this is the second time. And I, I hope for him that they are winning today because I... I like this guy. I absolutely like this guy. Niners all the way. See? All right. So we got how many people? This is crazy. How many people? It's like 75%. I cannot see it on the screen here. Need to make it bigger. Now I can see it. 79% <laughs> are for are watching the Super Bowl tonight. I'm, I'm pretty sure that more people are watching the Super Bowl beside us. But this is absolutely great. Chase here. Mahomes all the way says OP Grizzly. Yeah, so fair enough. I think it will be, it will be a close game. So giving you some, uh, some hints, right? Um, because there's ahead also some people of you were waiting we dropped that a long time ago at Topper Store in the United States. And now I thought it was time to bring that to Europe. And because there's there's a story behind that, right? And Snakey knows. <laughs> and I made a mistake to get this head organized for Snakey. And uh, that's the reason why I said, okay, now we bring it, bring it over. Inky Smudge, thank you for the sub, sir. Thank you very much. And look at this beauty. I mean, this is this is an absolute crazy hat, right? For uh, for spring times. Will the Rough Riders be this week? No, the Rough Riders will not be this week because the Rough Riders will be a drop that we are doing simultaneously at Harvester Europe and Harvester USA. And these drops. You can already prepare. These drops are from now on being on Sunday. So in the stream, this will be the in-stream drop. So this will be one of the first in-stream drops Sunday, Topper Store USA, Topper Store Europe. And um, we try, so when everything arrives, right, which is currently a little bit weird, um, we, will, we will then do a simultaneously drop for Europe and the United States on the stream on Sunday, right? So, hmm. almost, almost missed the stream, just came back from KFC. <laughs> oh my God, what did you get at KFC? I'm so fucking hungry already. I'm so fucking hungry already and I'm craving for these chicken wings. I have to go directly with my car afterwards uh, to Hooters and pick up my chicken wings. 
Oh my God. Oh my God. What did you get from KFC? I love KFC. I love it. I absolutely love it. The, the best thing KFC ever had was this. I don't know how it was called. So I, I got it in Germany. Was the Rizzy get busy. Shout out to my friend from Brazil. Thank you for tuning in, my friend. Um, the best thing was uh, this low carb uh, burger they had. Low carb, like without bread. And there was, there was, uh, instead of bread, it was like one uh, piece of chicken, fried chicken. Then there was ham and cheese inside. And then there was another uh, piece of fried chicken. I mean, I love that. Boneless chicken strips are only good thing. Ah, no, nah, come on. This, man, come on. This is the question which is absolutely important, okay? And this this makes, this this is, I'm sensitive about that topic, Bongo. I'm super sensitive about that, okay? Now, this is a very important poll we need to do, right? Because I want to know. So, chicken wings only I can't wait how to see how this question turns out, okay? Because this is a, this is like stickers on and off. Okay, vote now. Chicken wings only with bones or boneless? See, this is the direction it should go. Exactly. Never eat chicken wings without bones. Come on! This should be, there should be five years prison on that. If you eat chicken wings without bones. Oh my God. Oh my God. From KFC without bones. Nah. Nah, yeah, and stop ordering all flats. <laughs> true that, true that. You know, there, there's one, there, the biggest benefit with the bones is um, they are like, they keep the, the fucking chicken wings super warm for a long time, right? I go with bongo, no bones. Really? Oh my God. Oh my God. Nah. I mean, boneless chicken wings are just long uh, chicken nuggets. I mean, I go, I understand if you go with chicken tenders, right? The long ones, chicken tenders. I, I get this. I, I go with you. But if you want to have classic chicken wings, I don't go with the boneless ones because it's absolutely, it's it's right. What Mr. Casanova said, it's like chicken nuggets, right? If I want to have chicken nuggets, okay, that's fine. But not saying boneless chicken wings. Sorry for crashing your stream. <laughs> Jay, no, that's fine. That's fine. No problem. No problem. All right. So, I mean, we have a clear result here. We have a clear result here. It's like, again, 80% going with bones. And that's the way you should go, right? That's the way you should go. Okay. So, let's go ahead. No boneless strips. No, the boneless strips, not the wings. Okay. I was already thinking about that. So, we... You can confirm that we are that we are on the same page regarding boneless wings, not boneless wings have to have bones, right? Please confirm Bongo. This is very important for me. This is very important for me. <laughs> okay, guys. So let's go ahead. We got some hats to show off. Um, we start with Topper Store in Europe now. And I tell you, this is going to be a fantastic week because I think you will love what you see. A lot of wishes that have been placed will be, will be fulfilled. I start with the first four hats. So let's see what you guys are saying. The first thing is, this is a double pack, a double pack of chrome domes and uh, chrome and royal domes because I love that this um, this uh, this 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 uh, colorway 
is is really great. And we are we are approaching. All right, you know what the best thing is after the Super Bowl? Let me know in the chat if you know what the best thing is after the Super Bowl. Bone in for sure. The lost Latvian knows what we are talking about. Yes. Say this here, my brother from Croatia. Thank you for tuning in, my friend. And shout outs to Osijek. Yes. So. Blank and brims. What did you say? What is the the best thing after after the Super Bowl is Valentine's Day? Nah, come on. I mean, I get it, okay? <laughs> the NBA finals? Um probably. But a lot of you guys are already already typing in what I what I wanted to, what I wanted to say. March Madness, fair enough. That's that's cool too. Um what the fuck valentine's day uh this is this is blank and rims you made my day this is something i was really not expecting and thank you for reminding me because i think it's in three days something like that right all-star game no a wrestlemania a wrestlemania xavi yes maybe uh on side leo thank you for the subs thank you sir thank you very much no uh the euros are coming and this is a crazy year right i mean there's a lot of good stuff that's happening but the best thing for me after the Super Bowl is always like it's like 11 days or something away that spring training starts in the MLB and we are going out there and getting some baseball back. This is super nice. I mean, I get it. We are going um, to the playoffs in the NBA, in the NHL. We got the March Madness. So, I mean, it's perfect, right? Then in Europe, all these soccer leagues are going to the championship and... Um, yeah, we got the Euro too. So we got the Euro too. And I can't wait for the Euro this year because I love the Austrian team. They're playing so good. All right. Let's start with this pack. And oh my God, super clean hats, super gorgeous. And this is the first one. And we got this white New York Mets logo in the front. And I don't know if you can see it. This is metallic blue in the back. Gives it a special pop. Oh my God. And... The Let's Go Mad 69 side patch. This has not been done that often from Topper Store and I really love that side patch. Super clean hat. This is the direction that we are going and um, we really want to make super clean, super nice hats that are variable in team colors, for example, this one, right? So there will be some crazy stuff from time to time, but I think it's time to break down the essentials and make those hats really, really nice. So this is the New York Mets version. And then, of course, and I know you guys were waiting exactly for this hat. You guys wanted the muscle bird. I got down in the lab and said, OK, I want to make a super clean muscle bird in team colors with some metallic touch. And this is what came out and I already curved it. <laughs> you know, when I'm getting super excited about a hat, you will always see it curved. <laughs> New summer hat. So we got a Kelly green UV and look at this muscle bird in the front. I mean, those metallics are super detailed and not that much, right? We got the T in the back and then the, the crazy thing, if you look at the T at this small lines in here, we added there the metallic blue gray. Then it got the golden bat. And of course, the muscle bird is also a metallic blue gray. And the leaf is in light navy, like the visor. And now look at this side patch. I mean, come on. This is probably currently, and I wanted to do it exactly like this. It is in white and um, it gives a nice contrast on the chrome dome. And the Toronto All-Star Game 91, this 91 side patch is really one of my favorites. I hope you guys like it and appreciate it too. We got a classic Cooperstown Betty on the back, no outline. This is how hats should be be done. Nuera flag in blue. I mean, come on. 
Isn't that a nice hat? Looks good. So, if you want to have this one, I'm pretty sure there are a lot of people uh, who want to have this hat. So, I don't know if it sells out or not, but be quick, get it. No restocks on these, right? So, the Chrome Light Royal pack. Then, already curved, yeah, uh, but it's, it's coming flat. <sighs> Sorry. Great side patch. Seeds, thank you very much. Yes, I absolutely like that. Beth, you are going crazy with these new releases. Ritzy, thank you very much. So we, made, we, we put in a lot of work of thinking about um, how those hats could be in a way that they look really, really good with a special touch, but also authentic, right? Because this is important for me in the direction that we want to go. So we don't want to throw together, I don't know, crazy colors or something like that. We really want to, I mean, this hat, for example, has also crazy colors, right? But this is uh, the color of a flamingo. So I think um, this is exactly where we want to go, right? More in this direction that those things come really together and um, being just great hats, right? Just great hats. So talking about great hats, and that's the reason why we start, for example, now with these uh, 5950 trucker hats. And we are going with the first releases. They are super clean, right? Super clean. We also listen um, to our friends like Berg, for example, who said, okay, not every hat needs the metallics. It's absolutely true. And if they're metallic, some metallics in these are just the authentic metallics where we can go like with, instead of cloud, grow, uh, cloud gray, we are going with uh, metallic silver. So, and if there is an all-star game side patch, um, it needs some metallic details. So this is the first one, and this is a pack of two, um, perfectly timing for uh, spring training. And we are going with the team that has currently so much buzz around it, and it's the Los Angeles Dodgers in a classic colorway. And then we are going with the all-star game side patch with the large golden star on the side. And this golden star, I mean, come on, this screams Los Angeles, right? And we got a flat Cooperstown baddie on the back. All of these have black guts with uh, a gray UV. So that's the first one. So, I mean, come on, it's just clean, right? It's just clean. And that's also the reason why we said um, we don't want to bring in those official um, spring training hats because we were thinking about back and forth what can we do and we really want to make uh, the stuff our own stuff in this case right so and the second one is I mean it's also super classic but that's that's the way we start and you cannot go wrong with this one right so it's in navy the New York Yankees with the Subway Series side patch. And this Subway Series side patch here is a little bit adapted with metallic silver and metallic blue. So it gives it a special touch, but this is an absolute classic. And if you're seeing something like, I don't know, this one, you can you can easily remove that. You, you can easily just throw it out, okay? Not, not a problem. These have to be in, but if you want to wear it, you can easily remove that. So that's... The second thing, right? So you guys were asking for bringing in classic trucker 5950s. There we go. Okay. Are the patches stitched? Yeah, of course, they, they're embroidered. So They're embroidered on, on, on the material. You can see it here. Same embroidery like you have on normal hats. Same embroidery. All right, so we are still waiting on a lot of hats that are arriving soon. So I just want to give you now a sneak peek preview of 
this week's special drops at Topper Store USA. And I love trucker fitteds. We literally don't have them in, in Brazil. Yeah, so this is your chance now. How do the trucker uh, fitteds fit? Um, they are true to size. So I have no issues with them. And I'm curving the brim and I'm good to go. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm good to go. And this is something in the meantime, I would like to ask you guys one more thing, right? So um, are you curving your fitteds? I just want to know that. Yes and no. Um, because it's also a, a lot of questions are coming in regarding the 5950A frame. And the 5950A frame is perfect for curving. It has a different brim. It has like the brim of the 940, uh, 940A frame. So this is absolutely perfect for curving, right? And this is why I want to know. So let me know, are you curving your brims? Yes or no? Because if yes, you will love, you will love the, the 5950A frame. It's, it's, this hat is made for curving. I mean, all of these hats could be curved cool, but this hat was made for curving, okay? So let's go ahead. Okay, let's go ahead. So I want to show you two very special hats that are dropping this week at Topper Store USA. So this will be uh, in-stream drops. And yeah, I think I can pull that down. It's very clear that you guys are, most of you guys, nearly everybody is curving its brims. <laughs> okay, so. Have you shown any Rockies? Wait for it. Next week there should, should arrive a Rocky, which is the, the ice cold pizza oven 2.0. 2.0. All right. So these two beauties are dropping at Topper Store USA this week. So we got two Louisville bats and oh my God, with the satin brim. And wait, in Europe, we got a pack coming, a black satin brim pack. You will love this one. And Bongo, yes. There's also Boston Red Sox coming because I know that the question would come. <laughs> so we are close to 110 people in here. Thank you very much, guys, for tuning in and welcome to this fantastic Super Bowl Sunday. I mean, this is the best day, probably the, the biggest man's day of all and this is the second one watch this louisville bats with also with a satin brim red satin brim and look at the details in the front logo can you see those two little bats flying around i mean i love bats right and then we got another bat on the side who is hitting the other bats that are fronting him away homering them out i was just about to ask i was first <laughs> i know you my friend i know probably probably i know everybody of you so if if i'm creating hats right you, i already told you that it's like ah okay i got i got a for sure like four or five people in here they will buy this hat ah okay and we made some hats for these people let's make some hats for the other ones right because this is something like, you know, it's it's like these small, um, I don't know how to call it, right? But these small bodegas or grocery stores back in the days where you go in and uh, the guy behind the counter already knows what you want to have. <laughs> and that's, um, that's, that's what it's uh, like. These coming to you. No, these two are now... United States. So this is the early preview of this week from the USA. I want to show you another one which is dropping in the United States. And I know 
that some of you guys want to have uh, St. Louis hats and there is one one arriving. Oh my God, I can't wait until this arrives. But this one is dropping in the United States this week with the World Series 26 side patch in a lot of copper like we had already back in the days and a classic. Didn't you say that these are also coming to the U later? Uh, no, it's the it's the the mascots are coming. And if you love pizza, because we were talking about the pizza oven the last time, if you love pizza, you should probably go for this beauty, which is dropping at Topper Store USA also this week. And I mean. Nothing in the United States except Connecticut, except Connecticut, I learned that, right? Is screaming more pizza than Brooklyn. So if you missed out on this one in the in-store drop, you should be ready this weekend for the Brooklyn Dodgers. Must Ritzy get busy. So this is dropping in the United States. Is this the 2.0 pizza? No, this is dropping in the United States. The 2.0 pizza is uh, the ice oven. Uh, what I what I, because some of you guys ask for uh, the Rockies and there is another Rockies coming. Um, crazy metallics. All right, guys. Are you ready for the big showdown? Show, showdown? No, showdown. If we go before we go to the big showdown, um, I would like to go into Discord and taking a look at your stream questions. Okay, so dun, 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 dun. there are some questions today. Okay, Cap Luki was the first one who was asking. Is there also an A-frame coming from the Angels? Yes, sir. There is uh, two very special versions. They have already been ordered, created, and are on the way. So, next question. Tony M is asking, can we please get a Clearwater Treasures with the same shark logo that dropped in the US and Europe? Not the same hat, but just with that logo. Yes, there is coming um, a Clearwater Treasures trucker fitted, 5950 trucker fitted. You'll love that one. Classic uh, camo coming to, to Europe. Bass, uh, yes, I show, I show you later one. I have one with me. Cap Chris, Hamburg. When will the A-Frame 5950 be available in Europe? They should arrive very, very soon. And um, we are dropping the same styles like the US did. So wait for it. Classic white socks, super nice, clean ones for the beginning. Local Lobo is asking, any more Dunedin or Pulaski Blue Jays coming to you or US? Uh, the Pulaski Blue Jays... Um, I don't think we have something in the pipe, but maybe something different that you will that you will love. I, I don't want to tell you which team now, because yeah, I don't want to say too much right now. <laughs> Capmaster Flash, any Midland Rockouts in the pipeline? Oh yes, sir. Oh yes, sir. There is one already over there. Um, I will show that off in the next stream. So don't miss the next stream. I'll show it off then. You've made the Jimmy G crossover. We need the Purdy. Um, Purdy might be hard to do uh, with a team from San Francisco. Jam kicks wait until the Super Bowl is over and then we uh, then we talk if we should do it or not. <laughs> no, just joking. Bongo. Um, Kingston pre-order must be soon. Um, yes, also because as I told you before, there is some troubles in the Red Sea regarding that all the ships have to go around a longer route because some some of these guys are shooting at the ships currently. And that's the reason why we have a small delay of two to three weeks. What about the community event? Yeah, this is something we should really make happen this year. So 
I will ask Snakey that we can start a discussion um, with the own channel in Discord this week because um, I think we should find a location somewhere in the middle, like in Germany maybe, where we can all come together. Uh, so everybody who has time and have a great evening or something like that. Okay, so thank you very much for the questions, my friends. So we are coming to the grand finale of today. Um, the Stripers 5950A frame in Europe 2 stays, I need to check. I, I will check until next week, okay, that I can give you a, a, a approved yes or no, right? Because I, I don't know currently. So some of you guys were asking for um, woodland camo, so classic woodland camo. And I, I think I already previewed this one. So watch out for this beauty. This is dropping soon. So we got the woodland crown. We got this burnt wood visor. So this is a perfect outdoor hat. And then we got from the Toledo Martens this fantastic feather in the front with metallic copper. And outdoor means a lot of sweating. <laughs> That's the reason why we did a black guts with green UV. Like it, Cuba? I think so, right? This is Europe. This is Topper Store Europe, right? Exactly. Early preview. So, talking about the early preview, something. A frames dropping tomorrow at Topper Store Europe. We got the New York Mets with the All Star Game side patch in a fantastic, nice colorway burnt wood, metallic red and gold, and gray, uh, Kelly Green UV. Then we got this. Beauty of an Indian's hat with the silver outlines, classic two-tone, also Kelly Green UV. And last but not least, this Dodger Stadium 60th anniversary. So A-frame scripts are dropping tomorrow at Topper Store in Europe. And now an early preview for all of you guys who love the A-frames before we come to the final hats that are dropping this week at Topper Store in Europe. So we made um, a super nice two-tone chrome dome pack. And these are the first three that will be dropping soon. So we don't have an exact date, but super classic ones. And look at this beauty. So we got the Oakland Athletics with the golden outline and then the dark green Ace logo and a very special World Series Battle of the Bay with golden background, a green, oh, there's one, thread out, so remove that, with um, a dark green snapback and a gray UV. Then we got this super clean black metallic pearl, White socks with the Comiskey Park side patch and a black snap Kelly Green UV. And last but not least, also Clark the Bear on a chrome dome with the Royal Visor and the All Star Game 1990 side patch. Okay, so last four hats that I'm showing off today. We got a hat that has been shifted to this week, um, from last week to this week. So we got now the last hats that I'm showing off. We got a Mets hat, we got an Indians hat, we got a White Sox hat, and we got a Cubs hat. Let me know in the chat which one you want to see first. Dun, dun, dun. So we got a Cubs hat, a White Sox hat, an Indians hat, and a Mets hat. Indians, White Sox, um, Indians, Mets, Indians, Mets, Indians, Mets, White Sox, White Sox, Mets, Mets, Cups, Mets, Sox, Indians, Sox, Mets, Mets. Okay, so it seems that the Mets has the most and I will reverse it now. So we show the Mets last, we show the Cups first, then we show, uh, <laughs> <laughs> then we show the Indians and then we show the White Sox. So we show the Cubs, 
the Indians, the White Sox, and then at least at la the last one will be the Mets, okay? So that's how I want to keep, um, to keep uh, the excitement alive, right? So the first one will be maybe something for Ross the Bear uh, because he likes those Cubs hats. And even though there is no cup copy in the front, there is a super nice copy as a side patch. And ladies and gentlemen, if you are not wearing your glasses, please put up your glasses because this is insane. There is no thread on this hat. Nearly no thread. There is something on the better man, which has no metallics on it. And this is a fantastic metallic combo you guys will love. So we got a dark green cops hat and ladies and gentlemen this is the best copper cups i've ever made it is super shiny okay look at this beauty and now look at the side patch be aware of the foul balls the cubby is running for the balls This cup script is crazy, says Kuba. Thank you very much. Ross the Bear, my favorite color. <laughs> and then we got this seashellish um, Batterman on the back. I mean, come on. Isn't that a beauty? Look at that shine. Yes, exactly. So. That's the first one of the final four. Then, I mean, this goes in the, in, in, into the same direction and I'm very sorry if I disappointed some of you guys last week that we shifted it to this week, but I think the wait for that beauty is absolutely worth it. So we got the Cleveland Indians on this walnut crown, uh, sorry, burnt wood crown metallic green and metallic copper jacobs field 10th anniversary side patch a fantastic flat cooperstown betty on the back a kelly green uv and white guts i mean come on this is a beauty this is a beauty super nice embroidery really nice shine Gives me Irish vibes. Hmm. You might be right. Okay, so. You guys wanted the 95 years White Sox side patch? You probably want to have it on a very special head, right? Because I promised that we bring it to Europe. Now it's your chance to get this beauty it's dropping this week at topper store in europe and i don't i don't need to describe this head right because you already know it metallic black pearl metallic red in this case and the 95th 95 years side patch classic cooperstown batty on the back i promised and there we go dropping this week. So I think it will be a crazy week, right? And now, perfect for the upcoming bread. Yeah. It's a super nice head. I mean, come on. More satin brims. And this is what I meant before in that colorway. Some more satin brims are coming. They're just a little bit different, those which are dropping in Europe because we used um, scarlet red in the back. So I can't wait to see what you guys are saying to that. Uh, wait for it, it's coming soon. All right, so this one, I mean, you know, I'm a Mets fan. I'm a huge Mets fan. And I just wanted to, I just wanted to use a logo because I really want to bring you guys new logos in Europe, right? What Saturn Brims you're talking about for Europe? Wait for it. Wait for it, Mr. Pink. They should arrive soon so that I can show them off. And I wanted to make a, a mascot hat which has a different logo. I think we have never seen that in Europe up to now. 
and I wanted to make a classic cap because my favorite color combo lately from the Mets is so even if maybe the hat is totally black, right? Or the hat is a two tone with a black dome and the royal visor, right? And because it's a dedication to Shea Stadium, I wanted to make it um I wanted to make it Kelly Green. And I also think this combination is super nice for you guys because I think we have never done that side patch before in Europe. So let's have a look if you like it. Oh, and Mr. Matt, of course, deserves a golden outline where he's looking out, right? Come on, look at this beauty. Could be an on-field head, right? And then we got the Shea Stadium 40th anniversary side patch. This goes so good together. This had closed the game. Thank you very much, Kuba. And that's what I meant, you know. I really want to bring those hats which are so authentic. And, you know, when you're at City Field, you know Shea Stadium was there. So, come on. This, is, this, is, this, this means a lot to me, this hat. Can you do a Bronx Bomber with the 73 side patch? Um, probably there is coming one more. Mm, let's see. Let's see. Um, I just can tell you because someone, so John was asking for a Babe Ruth hat. Uh, wait for, wait for a special Yankees hat that are coming soon for Derek Cheater. Mets this week, yes. All of the hats that I've shown are this week, except uh, of the Toledo Mutt hands. This was just an early preview. And also the, the Chrome Dome A-frames, these were early previews. But overall, all the other hats are coming this week. So you see, we are shifting to something more condensed in 5950, but on a very unique level. And I can't wait to show you guys off what's coming in the next week. So in the next stream, there is something I would like to change and I would like to that you know it already. So we have a stream. Uh, now we have a channel in, in Discord, which is called Make a Wish, right? And I already told you, um, but I need to revamp the studio first because then we can line that in on the screen, is that I want to go week by week over that channel because I want to give you a feedback. Some of you guys said, oh, is there ever coming a feedback? No, the hats are coming, right? So not everything, but this is what I want to talk to you about. When you're dropping in pictures there, which logos you want to see, we can go through them and we can talk about them because then I can directly tell you it's possible or it's not possible, right? So that's what I want to do. I hope you appreciate that. And guys, I would like to thank you to that you also switched over to to uh, to Sunday with me. This means a lot to me. Thank you very much. And today I just I just can wish you a super nice Super Bowl day or for you for us guys in Europe night late night morning right. And if you want to discuss something about the Super Bowl, do it in Discord. We have our own NFL channel there. And if you're making photos, please tag me at Petlander24 or at Topper Store or at Topper Store USA. We want to see how you celebrating your Super Bowl party tonight. This would be great. And yeah, I just can say go Niners. And thank you very much for tuning in. And as we say in Austria, <laughs> Pfiat euch.